Well, Warpugs, like with any series that I have started, we are now at the end of the episodes that have already been released. And soon, very soon as a matter of fact, because the person that does the songs for these just released a massive update in the form of a brand new saga, um, soon and probably already, um, the great animators that have been bringing these songs to visual life are going to be putting together new these new chapters for us to enjoy. And to be quite honest with you, I can't wait until that happens. I honestly can't wait. This series has been very, very special to me from a practical standpoint. Um, it's allowed me to explore a lot of topics that I just don't normally talk about. I just don't normally go into these things. And there have been a good many of you along for the ride for that. And I'm glad, and I, I've seen, you know, some of you subscribe. I've seen some, I've read just about every comment that you guys have left. And it's been amazing to me the, um, the feedback that I've gotten and the, um, it's overwhelmingly positive. Um, like my normal core group of people have really enjoyed this, the War Pugs. And we've gotten some more, we gotten some new members over the past few months of me checking this out. And now that I'm at this, at this kind of a fork in the road, while where, you know, it's less of, less of me actually um, being told by you guys to hurry up and get to the next part of the saga. Um, now we're all waiting. And... It'll be worth the wait. I really do believe. I believe wholeheartedly it's going to be worth the wait. Now, God Games. Odysseus has been captured by Calypso. Um, Odysseus' son has Athena, you know, standing up with him. But Athena has now been made aware of what's going on with Odysseus himself. This is from Neil Illustrator, guys, and Neil was good enough to reach out and let us know that, let me know here that he had checked out. He he liked it. He liked it. I'm telling you what, no matter how much he enjoyed seeing my video, I swear to God, it was something very special to see that. It was something very special to see his rendition of Thunderbringer. You guys had been hyping that up for quite a while, and it was worth the wait and gold. So, here we are again with Neil Illustrator, and this is God Games. So, I'm going to shut up. Let's get into it. All links are in the description down below. Be sure to check out Neil Illustrator. Subscribe to him. Subscribe to me. Leave a comment. Let's go. And like the video, by the way. Divine intervention, is that what you seek? To untie apprehensions that were placed on that Greek? You are playing with thunder for a man full of shame, but if he's worth the risk of going under, why not make it a game? Convince each of them that he ought to be released, and I'll release him. Who's that? Apollo! Hephaestus! Aphrodite! Ares! Hera! Or me? What do you say? It's good he didn't bring it Poseidon. Alright. Bring it. Apollo! <laughs> So with so many sirens gone, I think God is in the wrong. They were trying to do him worse. All he did was reimburse them. Now they'll tread with caution first to live another day and sing another verse. If that's true, release him. Okay. Avestus. 
Trust is not given his forge. Why should I give in my support? He sacrificed his own cohort. Did you forget they failed to listen? He was betrayed and then imprisoned. But if you make the right decision, he can still build a future with those who miss him. Fine, release him. Oh, nice. Odysseus claims to love his mother, but let her die of a broken heart. He was busy fighting, more like busy spiting. The Cyclops let him feel the pain that his mother felt and wrought. Wait! Please reconsider this. Really, Athena? These old tricks. What kind of sick coward holds back his power while his friends get devoured? He didn't even fight Scylla, didn't even try to kill her! Hides inside a wooden horse to get the job done! Never handles things up front, but that can weak like his son! Ooh! Hold your tongue now! He said my friend! And tell your lover that a broken heart can mend! You want True. Uh, <sighs> hey, baby. So many heroes, so many tales. Give me one good reason why you should bring them. He's got the mind of a genius, right? Harder. He's pretty skilled with words. You can do better than that. He's kind of funny. Eh. Never once has he cheated on his wife. Release him. Oh. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> oh, she went with that one. I played your game and won. Release him. You dare to defy me, to make me feel shame. No one beats me. No one wins my game. Thunder, bring her through the ring. Show her I'm the judgment call. The one who makes the kingdom fall. Is she dead? Okay, I seriously feel... <laughs> I feel like I have gone through an entire season of just like... This was like a full out... Th this, this was like a full out... Season. In a single shot. First of all... Perturabo, the Man of Iron, is walking among us. But, her reasoning with each one of them was absolutely amazing. Okay, first off, Apollo, they kind of did deserve it. Okay, 100%. Now, I want to talk real quick about Neil's portrayal of Athena, okay? Now, in other portrayals of Athena, she is a lot more slimmer, a lot more... Um, a lot more lithe in terms of her presentation there. In this particular presentation, she's a lot 
bulkier. She, she, like, this girl has been eating a lot of protein, okay? She has been ready to go for some time. Now, the difference between the two, you have one of, one, one perception of Athena that is, I'd say, this perception of Athena looks more brute force, while other perceptions that I've seen of her, other, other interpretations, not perceptions, uh, other interpretations, just a lot more strategic, a lot more um, thought out um, in terms of how she engages in, engages in warfare. Now, neither of these is wrong. And both of them, both of the ways that she is presented have their merits. It's just like any other, any other, any other real like warrior that you would see. And you take it, take into effect, um, like from Game of Thrones, the mountain and the viper. One was a, a very slim down, small, lithe fighter. The other one was an absolute monster. But this particular interpretation of Athena is very, very different than what I've seen before, but I automatically know who I'm looking at. I already know who this is supposed to be, who she's supposed to represent, and it's because of the skill of the artist that that is put out. I'll just say that, because if you were to ask me you know, if you were just to tell me, okay, this is a Greek goddess, which one is she? I would I would pick but maybe two names here. Um, maybe Hera, but Athena would be there as well. And of course, this absolute the way that he represents, the way that he Neil illustrates here, uh, Zeus, the cocky arrogance of him, the nonchalance which quickly morphs into anger. I can much appreciate that. I can much appreciate that. Of course, Aphrodite, what are you going to say? Like, really, what are you going to say? Apollo, exactly what you would expect. Um, not really that difficult. Not, not really that difficult to tell who he is. Um, Ares, on the other hand, I can much appreciate... I can much appreciate the way that this was put out. Now, the only thing that I'm seeing... Oh, and the Hera scene. Oh, my God. The, he never cheated on his wife. Literally, some, I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. We don't really need to go any further into that now, do we? Now, there was one thing that the fight between Athena and Zeus, the fight between Athena and Zeus, that one slightly confused me. That one, that one was a bit confusing. And it might be because I wasn't, it might be because I missed some, some, some subtle details. It might be because I was looking in the wrong place, but there was some things about that that did confuse me. But the one thing that I liked the most of it was we got to see Zeus actually irritated. Um, and we also get to see one thing above everything, like the fact that she hugs him and Zeus is comforting her even though they were just fighting father daughter that is that is pretty much how that goes i can appreciate that i can appreciate that but the biggest thing out of all this is the fact that she went in to went into the gods and stood up for odysseus and claimed him as a friend, even though their friendship has been on hold for quite some time. 
Now, after this, there is no question in my mind. Her reasoning for Ares was, you know, flat out simple. Ares just wants conflict. And if, if, if Odysseus is released, there is going to be conflict. But she stood up for him at the end. She, this, this story is about several characters changing, and the biggest two are Odysseus and Athena right now for me. And I'm just hoping there's some repro reproachment between the two of them. I really do. This has been a great series for me in so many ways. And I can't wait to see more. I can't wait to see more from Neil. I can't see, wait to see more from Gigi Cinema. I can't wait to see more from Duva Box. <sighs> and any of the other artists I've been, like, that I have seen throughout this time, and just for, just my brain is not what it is it used to be, guys. I just can't wait to see more. Now, as far as what I'm going to do from here, I know that I want to separate them into the different sagas and re-upload. I don't know when I'm going to do that. I'm stupidly busy it's just the nature of the beast but i think i'll be giving that a shot guys thank you for joining me during this journey thank you for joining me during this entire like and this is the greatest thing about youtube this is the best thing about youtube i have said this several times is that you, you're not gonna get this you're not gonna get this from you know anywhere else It'd be washed down, corporatized, put through seven filters, and then delivered to a screen. But here, we just see, in this particular case, what the artist heard in all of this. And the music itself is an absolute masterwork. War Pugs, I'm going to head out here. Remember to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch you on the next one of these when I see that later. Until then, check out something else, and I'll catch you guys next time.